What's going on guys, girls, not by any of you, it's back in another video. And this time, we're playing Pokemon TCG Online. And what I want to do in this video is I want to open some card packs. Um, as you can see here, I saved up some card packs. I'm still really uh, new to the game, so I don't have much cards. So I bought some cards on Amazon, and I, and I um, used a QR code to get some packs. I already earned some of them. I think I earned two, so I think I earned... Which one did I earn? I earned this one. And I think I earned that one. So uh, all of them, that's what I earned. Um, so what we're going to do in this video, we're going to open um, some cards from least to greatest. So we're starting way though. We're here to open this first. So let's get started. Woohoo. I have a card collection box. Ooh. Diamonds below. I have, oh, I got, wow, that's a lot of things that have been added. Okay. Well, that's pretty cool. <laughs> okay. Let's start with this. Let's see what we get. Okay, I'm super excited. We're gonna look at all of them after the video and all the details. <laughs> all this makes me really excited. So what is it? Ooh, okay, nice. Time for the next one. This makes me super excited. <laughs> What is it? Oh, it's a seal. A Drawong. That's from my, my childhood, man. Oh, I remember like, my red with all those Pokemon. Oh. And what is it? Oh, God. It's Kerbs. Okay. Time for this one. It's called Breakpoint. Ooh. It's sexy. So what Papa gets for dinner. Mmm. Okay. That looks really good. Let's look at that one. Looks good. Looks good. Looks great. Looks lovely. Looks sexy as icing on a cake. Okay. Design that. I don't know if really cool design that. Okay, that looks cool. Next, we open them another. Oh, we have two of these? Oh, we have three. We had three of those. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even realize. I guess it makes sense. I just have a lot of those cards when I get bought the physical version of Amazon. If you wonder what I buy about the Ultimate Trainer Edition thing, Jig. So, oh, I got one of those too. I got several of those. I got one of those. I didn't get a Geodude, unfortunately. I got one of those too. Oh, that design looks really cool. I got one of those except it was um, a Vulpix design of it and it was right next to a tree. So that's really cool. So. Last one of these kind. Okay. That's what get. Oh yeah, I didn't get one of those though. I, I wanted one of those. I got this one though. I, I will admit, I was happy when I got that one. Cause I remember fa going uh, facing against that. Oh man, was it insane? There we go. Last one this time. Okay. And I got a metric fuck ton of energies too when I bought it. I got probably got like 60 to 70 energies. I got one of those too. Um, which is insane if you really think of. It. Oh my god, how many do I have of these? I guess I have seven. Oh my god, it's getting to go out. <laughs> I might just have to speed through it. That's how many I got. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I got one of those too. That was, I was really happy when I got one of those. Okay, let's see what this is. That's why I call it a sexy ass big potato. I got the exact same card of that one too. What I really got was uh, stuff against my opponent. Uh, so like I get this, I got a card that can discard a lot of cards from my opponent. And I got one where I could, uh, it was a card effect of a Pokemon. It wasn't like a trainer card or anything. Whoa, that's sick. Oh man, we're getting a lot of cool cards. Design on that card is really cool. Mm, I got one of those. 
Got that. Got that. That's a good damage. Uh, I got one of those, so I got two of those. So I'm good. I got one of those too. I didn't get that one, unfortunately. I got hard sleeps too, but it didn't go to all of them. It wouldn't fit all of them. What I mean by that is like if I got one of those. What it means that. Uh, oh my god! Sorry, I just used my pants on. I apologize. Did not expect that. Yeah, I'm on those two. I got those hammer things, the man's hammers. One should I choose first? I said least the greatest, so I guess we have to do this one. Let's see what Papa gets. Okay. Interesting. Number one. Ooh, I like the I like the way that looks. Ooh, hello. Okay, last one. Then we're gonna take a look at all the things we got. Strong. Ooh, well, that was a really cool looking one. Oh, we kind of. Oh, actually, we did. We kind of. The design on that one looks really cool. Um, alright. Well, uh, as much as I would love to say that I could get more, unfortunately, as you can see, I only have 103 coins. And. Boost packs cost at least 200. Well. Kind of sucks. Um. But, anyways, let's look at. Let's look at what we got in our collection because we got a lot of things I want to look at. Okay, let's look at this first. Uh, future sites, Absol. It's a basic. Oh, nice. It says 100 health. Look at the top four cards of either player's deck and put them in back in any order. So basically, if that person had a something break, I, I don't remember. It's been a while. I'm not, I'm a papa. I mean, I'm still kind of new to this. And when I was a kid, we had nothing called Mega EXs and we didn't have any breaks and whatever we just had your regular basic pokemon and when i was a boy <laughs> i sound so old i remember buying getting getting some of those card packs because i used to beg my mother for some and whatnot mother and dad and all i'd get was were angie's hardly ever did i get a single pokemon and it used to make me so mad and at the same time sad because i wanted some pokemon i didn't want i didn't care about no damn energies even though that's what you really need to actually you know do your moves and whatnot so that's really cool Okay, so what do we have next? Geodude, I think this is new. Rock Paul is during your next turn. This Pokemon has no retreat cost. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, I don't know about that. That one's not. Eh. It's it's interesting, but it's not too that interesting. Let's see. A low one graveler. Thunder Punch. Flip a coin of heads to attack this 20 more damage. It tells to attack this 20 damage you set. Ooh, that ouch. Um, Electro Bullet, this attack does 20 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Do not apply weakness or resistance for the bench Pokemon, okay? Okay, sorry. Alone Rad Attata. Null is 20. And as I said, I got a Vulpix version of it, um, and my physical version of this. And it was by an extra tree, it was really cool, I really liked the design. Okay. <clears throat> Flip a coin of heads, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks during your opponent's next turn. Okay, so that could be really interesting. Say I'm losing by a little bit, like maybe he has two prize cards and I don't. I could probably use that move several times and um, if I get heads, I can not take any damage. I can make myself stay in the fight a lot longer, so that's really cool. I might actually use that in a deck. Um, put a basic Pokemon from either player's discard pile and onto its owner's bench. Okay, so basically you can bring your Pokemon back to life. I like it, I like it. Hydro Splash is 60. And B Palm. Okay. Fury Chance. This card is the top card of your opponent's deck. If that card was an energy card, this attack does 60 more damage. Okay, so I can get rid of a card in his deck and deal 
a lot bit more damage. That's good. That's good. <clears throat> Flip two uh, coins. This attack does 50 damage times the number of heads. Okay. 50 damage. So does it have 50 regardless? Does that mean it can do 150 right off the bat? Did I get two heads? Or is it just 100 total? I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, that's not new. Oh, I think this is new, isn't it? I, th I think this is new. <clears throat> Search your deck for up to three water type cards, reveal them, and put them into your de hand. Shuffle your deck afterward. Mm, that's nice. And does freezing wind is 100. That's nice. Uh, chilling sigh. Your opponent's. Uh, active hook one is not asleep. That's awesome. Flip three coins to attack this four damage. Four damage for each head. So I could do 120, right? 40, 80, 90, 100. Yeah, 120. As mural, okay. Flip a coin if heads stack this 30 more damage, okay. Bubble drain, heal 30 damage from this Pokemon, okay. And does 80 damage as well, it seems. Bar Boach, Hoke, Hook is 10, much left is 20, alright. I don't, I, oh well. Search your deck for three different types of energy, a little basic energy cards and attach them to your Pokemon in any way you like. Okay, that's good. Shuffle your deck after it's like, that's good because if I have a card that's uh moves based off how many energy cards it's attached to it, it's based off uh, how much damage I can do, then that can really help me a lot. Heal 40 damage from each of your bench Pokemon. That's really good. That's a really good move. At least to me, this discard an energy card from this Pokemon, so just 20 damage for a steel type energy. Vine Whip, does 30 damage, cross two energy. Beware. Be beware. Beware. No. <clears throat> Break it in. It's ability when you play this Pokemon from your hand, evolve one your, of your Pokemon uh, during your. Your turn, you may draw three cards. Okay, that's really good. Dangerous blow. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now. Your Pokemon active Pokemon is in a basic Poke. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm, I apologize. If your opponent's active Pokemon is a basic Pokemon, this attack does 60 more damage. Okay. I don't think that's new, but definitely cool looking. Uh, this Pokemon does 10 damage to itself. Blitzel, 20 damage, 1 cosmo energy. Let's see here. Okay, here it is. Carbona, bite, 10 damage. Cast form. Weather, weather Tailor, search up a deck for two stadium cards, reveal them, put them in your hand, then shuffle your deck afterward. Water pulse, your opponent's active Pokemon is down to sleep. Okay. That's 30 damage. <clears throat> that is the weirdest looking bug I have ever seen. Oh god, it's so fucking weird and stupid. Oh, what happened to the cool Pokemon, man? I remember when I played Pokemon, they had a lot of cool Pokemon. They didn't have any of the stupid stuff they have now. What happened? I mean, not granted, they do have a lot of hidden gems in there. They have really, some really cool new Pokemon, so. Um. That I like. So, I mean, it's not all bad, but, like, most of them are stupid. So. Really, it makes me sad. Okay, so shocking job for the coin of heads. Your opponent's active Pokemon is not paralyzed. Does 20 damage per per attack. Uh, Electro Ball does 50 damage. Chikorita tackle is 10. Blot heal damage from this Pokemon. It also does yeah. yeah. Bell of Silence. Your opponent can't play any Pokemon that has an ability from their hand during the last turn. Clefairy, 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 Clefairy. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep. Um, and it's a lullaby. During your next turn, this Pokemon's Meteor Mash does 60 more damage. So it stacks up? Is that what you're telling me? If that's the case, then oh my god, that could be lethal. I also didn't get this exact, uh, version of Clefairy and whatnot. I got different ones. I also got Chansey and the evolution of Chansey, I think. Uh, whatever. 
Slap does 10 damage, follow me. Switch over one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. Okay. That's a really cool design. I like that. Really cool. Dust Gathering, draw a card. Okay. Cottony, Continuous Tumble. Flip a coin. If you get Tails, this attack does 10 damage for each head. Okay. Since a quail, tackle, 10 dam tackles, 10 damage, ember, discard a uh, energy attached to this Pokemon, does start damage. All the presents, flip a coin until you get tails. For each head, so you may search your deck for a card and put it into your hand and then stuff your deck. That's good because if you think about it, if you strand cards, they always limit you to what you can get. So if that's if I if I'm thinking they can get any card you want from any order you want throughout your deck, then that's really good because you can get, you, maybe you're missing the evolution to one of your Pokemon, and you and that would help you uh, get ahead of your opponent because maybe he has one more prize card than you and his um Pokemon that he ha that's active ha has damage on it and he's so close to dying, but you have next to no Pokemon with energy on them and you have um practically no energy at all in your hand and the only energy you have from maybe previous turns on a Pokemon is your main Pokemon that you wanted to evolve. So this card could help you um, get that Pokemon. However, I think I just contradict myself. But I'm an idiot because, you know, no energies, no move. Okay. But you get what I mean. So. The coin of Tails, this attack does nothing. Well, I guess I'm going to be doing a whole lot of nothing with that Pokemon. <sighs> the Wong. The Gong. Now this is from my childhood. This is this brings me back. The Battle of the Elite Four and uh, Pokemon Fire Red was my first Pokemon game I ever played, and oh man, it brings back so many memories. Oh, so fun, so much fun. Really enjoyed it. Heal 40 damage from this Pokemon. Switch to this Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. That's good. That's really good. It only costs one energy too. Take down. Pokemon does 20 damage to itself, but does 9 to the opponent. I think that's worth it. Dugong, again. Dugong. Sorry. Sorry, I burped something. Excuse me. Flip a coin if he if it'll be flip a coin. If heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is not paralyzed. If tails, your opponent's active Pokemon is not asleep. So it's good either way. In my opinion. My lord, what's wrong with me? Okay. Aurora Beam costs 4 energy and does 100 damage. What does retreat cost? Actually, I'm curious. Okay, its retreat is three. Okay. Clefairy, Clefairy, Clefairy. Sorry. Bionis Skirt Submerge, as long as this Pokemon is in on your bench, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks. Both yours and your opponents. I didn't know I could, I could attack my own Pokemon. Man, this is an old Pokemon, man. I remember getting this in some car card packs when I was young. I don't know why, but to me, Diglett was always a very iconic Pokemon. I never knew why. I always recognized it. Like, that's the one that stuck out to me the most. I know that makes no sense because there's a lot more Pokemon that are a lot more intricate. So, yeah, it's kind of weird. Dig through this type of third damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. And then it costs two energy. I don't... Okay, the duo, but three coins, this attack is 10 times the number of heads, so one energy for 30 attack, I think that's okay. That's, that's not bad. I'm trying to look for the ones that have new on them, that way I can, I want to get this video as quickly as possible because I think I'm getting pretty, uh, you know, it's really starting to get long. Uh, Durant, discard the top of your opponent's deck, card from the top of your opponent's deck, then does two damage as well, scrape down. If this Pokemon has any damage counters on it, it's got the top four cards of your opponent's deck. Cost two energy. Knock the buzz, one energy. It costs for uh, Thundershock, but the coin of heads your opponent's uh, active Pokemon is now paralyzed, does 10 damage. Thunder Punch, flip a coin. If heads, this attack does 10 damage. Uh, 10 more damage. If tails, this Pokemon does 10 damage to itself. Okay, and does 30 damage total. So you have the opportunity to do 40 damage with 2 energy. 
Um, flip a coin. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm an idiot. Ability, buzz, buzz up thunder. That's a weird name. Once during your turn, before you attack, you may knock out this Pokemon and reach it, it attach it to one of your uh, blah, 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 electric, uh, little electric type Pokemon as a special card. This card provides two energy only while this card is attached to that Pokemon. So that could really help if you're running low on energy and you need uh, the extra energy for the extra, for other Pokemon. That's really good. Why not? Execute. Hypnosis, cosmic energy, your opponent's active Pokemon is not asleep. Uh, Ram, cosmic energy, it's grass energy. Furrow seed. I really like this Pokemon. This Pokemon is really cool too. During your opponent's next turn, if this Pokemon would be damaged by attack, prevent the attack's damage done to this Pokemon. If this damage is, if that damage is 60 or less. Okay, so it, it can't be 120. You can't prevent 120 damage I'm hitting you, you have to be 60 or less, okay, that kind of limits it, but I think it's good for maybe early game, if you can get energy on it that quickly at least. <coughs> Growl, during your opponent's next turn, the defending Pokemon uh, on the attack do 20 less damage, that's really good. Um, cost 1 energy, flap does 20 damage, cost 2 energy. Uh, Frogier, or Frogadier, cut, 30 damage. Like I said, I'm trying to get through it as fast as possible, because I don't want to make this video too long. Uh, for Fro, draw a card, it's called Collect, and it's one, uh, energy. Tight Jaw, if the coin of heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed, cost two energy. Goodbye, Sand Tumble. The Penny Pokemon can't retreat during your opponent's next turn. Does 20 damage. Cost one fighting energy. <clears throat> Does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to all of your Pokemon. And it's called Power Storm. Oh, this is. Oh, I didn't even realize I had this. Wait a second. No, wait, no, I'm good. I'm good. I thought I was being. I'd be, I was being stupid. Okay. Um, that's really good. This card is a really good card. Swift Lunge, your opponent switches the defending Pokemon with one of his or her bench Pokemon. Okay. Does 8 damage. Get a sec EX, dude. I don't remember getting this at all. I'm still on the training ladder, too, to get that other EX that they have. Okay. Get a sec EX. Once during your turn, before you attack, you may put a Pokemon tool card attached to this Pokemon into your hand. Okay, so you can get rid of a uh, Pokemon tool just in case this is about to die and you don't want to lose that tool. And you attach to another Pokemon. That's good. That's really cool. Uh, Rapid Blaster. This card, a, as many uh, Steel type energies. I believe that's Steel type. Uh, this card, as many Steel type energy, you attach to this Pokemon as you'd like. This attack does 20 more damage for each card discarded in this way. 20 more damage. So it says it has 100 plus. Is that amount that it goes to before it? can't do any more damage or is that like it adds tw like that does 20 like on its own so say you had one energy or three energies attached to it um you, you can do it once and it would be a total of 120 or does it just do 20 i don't know if that's like i said there's sometimes i feel like i don't know well it actually does have a plus right by it so it makes more sense if it does more than 100 i have this card too <clears throat> Flip a coin, if heads, discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. If this Pokemon has any damage counters on it, this attack does a more damage. And that's Raging Flow. And then another one was Crunch, the first one I said. Cost 2 energy, second one cost 3. Uh, if your opponent's active Pokemon has no more damage counters on it before this uh, attacks, do, this attack does 20 does damage it, this tech does nothing I'm sorry I I have a really bad stutter and I apologize basically um, if this if you're active my if, if, if your opponent's active Pokemon has no damage counters on it um, this tech uh, does this tech does damage just wait what 
Okay, so basically this attack will look nothing if your opponent has no damage counters on it. So in other words, you won't be able to do damage. I'm sorry, I just, yeah, I guess I'm an idiot. Guillotine does 90 damage, uh, 3 energies. This is really cool, I really like the way this looks. Ah. Unfortunately, I have, I have that one, but I don't have the Gudra, unfortunately. This attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to this Pokemon. Uh, oh, so that's really good. 12 year points Pokemon. Hey, what? I don't understand. This attack does 20 damage times the, num the amount of energy attached to this Pokemon to one of your opponent's Pokemon. What does it mean? Is it talking about how much it will do more damage if a whole bunch of other Pokemon have energy on it too? I don't understand. Uh, I'm tired, I'm sorry. Your opponent switches their active Pokemon with one of their bench Pokemon. It does 130. If the point it heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Slap, Sidebeam, okay, where is it? This one is another cool looking version of it. <coughs> Slap does 20 damage. Sidebeam, your opponent's active Pokemon is now. Just not confused, okay. Hakamoo? What? Hakamoo? Hakamoo? It's a dragon type, and it looks actually pretty cool. Surprisingly. Kinda cool, actually. I changed my mind. Nova Roar. Your opponent switches their active Pokemon with one other bench Pokemon. Dragon Claw. It's 40 damage. Alright. Not too impressed. One damage for a headbot and does 30. Okay. Uh, three damage. I mean, not three damage. Three energy types uh, for a dragon claw and does 80 damage. The point of has this attack does 20 more damage. Okay, so one energy for 40 damage. That's actually not half bad. I really like that. This attack does 30 damage to one of your bench Pokemon. Okay, so this hurts me as well. Alright, well that's fair. Helot Heliotile? Hel Helotile? Heloptile? You know what I mean. Other coin of heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Herdier. Herder, or whatever it's called. Treasure Hunt, it's ability. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may put it put a item card from your discard pile into your hand. Okay, that's pretty cool. Three energies for fifty damage. <sighs> Bite. Okay. Like I said, I'm really tired. I'm slept for a little bit, so bulletproof. This Pokemon takes ten less damage from attacks after playing weakness and resistance. It has no resistance, but it does have weakness. Okay. What is that? Fairy? I can't tell. Uh, Dragon Claw does 30 damage. Uh, Diggy Cloth, roll out, does 10 damage, cost 1 energy, double slap. So, 2 coins, the, this attack is 20 damage for each head. Okay. Kakuna. Really cool version I found here. Which roll my body today? Oh my god. During your opponent's next turn, any damage done to this Pokemon by attacks is reduced by 40. Okay. Flip a coin, it heads your opponent's active Pokemon is now poisoned. Cool. That's really cool. I really like that. King is gone. If your opponent's active Pokemon is an evolution Pokemon, this attack does 30 more damage. So 60. Cool. Flip four coins, this attack does 50 damage for each head. Wow. So. 100, 150, 200. It does the second dude 200? That's really nice. A bit of quick math. I hated this Pokemon so much. It was I thought it was such a stupid Pokemon to ever created. It's 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 pretty fucking stupid. I'm not gonna lie. I wish this Pokemon was never created at all. But we're gonna read it regardless. Just give me a little bit. Cause I'm another god. 
that y'all was actually pretty appropriate for this Pokemon. That's how boring I feel it is. It makes me yawn. Once during your turn, before you attack, if this Pokemon is on your bench, you may discard all cards attached to this Pokemon and attach it to one of your Pokemon as a tool card. Okay, that's interesting. Prevent any damage done to the Pokemon this card is attached to by attacks from your opponent's Mega Evolution Pokemon. Oh, it's only Mega Evolution, huh? Well, that's kind of stupid. If this card is attached to a Pokemon, discard this card at the end of your opponent's turn. Okay. Very one does 30 damage. Alright. Uh, Will of Whiffs does 30 damage. This is probably one of the coolest designs I've seen. Personally. Right here. I just got this, so what do I, I don't know why it's not saying new. Oh well. Daunting pose, you prevent all damage done to your bench Pokemon by your opponent's attacks. What? Prevent all damage done to your opponents done to your bench Pokemon by your opponents. Okay, so it okay, never mind, I'm an idiot. Your opponent's attacks and abilities can't put damage counters on your bench Pokemon. Well that really helps. So cross chop. Have a coin if heads attack is twenty. This attack does 30 more damage. Okay, so 60 total. Dual chop, flip two coins, this attack does 30 damage for each head. Say what? Okay, never mind. Dynamic chop does 50. Ah, there's my favorite Pokemon. There, this is my favorite Pokemon ever. Always will be my favorite Pokemon too. I always loved fire types more than any other type, and this is why. I think this is one of the coolest Pokemon ever created. Magma Mantle, this you made this card the top card of your deck. If that card is a fire type entity, this attack does 50 more damage. 67 80 so does 8 damage, okay. Heat blast does 8 damage, okay. So it could be either or. Just gotta get lucky. Gotta have the luck. You gotta have the luck in hand, you gotta be willing to give that luck over to people in demand as many cards as you like from your hand, he'll 10 damage from this Pokemon for each card you discard it discarded in this way. Okay. Dwindling Wave. This attack does 90 damage minus 10 damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. Okay, so it'll slowly do nothing then, right? Because it'll go down to 80, then 70, then 60, 50, 40, 32, uh, 30, 20, and then 10. Then nothing. <coughs> Moo Moo Malt. As long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, whenever you attach an energy card from your hand to one of your Pokemon, heal 9 damage from that Pokemon. That's really that's a really good move. The coin if heads, this attack does 30 more damage, so 70, 80, 90, does 90 damage total. Sit down and splash. Double kick. Flip two coins, this attack does 30 damage for each heads. Okay, cool. Murkrow, Whirlwind. Your opponent switches their active one of their bench Pokemon. 10 damage. Ram, 20 damage. Rising Lunge, 30 plus. If the point of heads attack 30 more damage. Or a uh, hero, just whatever. Passionate Dance. Search the deck for up to three basic uh, fire type Pokemon. Put them onto your bench and shuffle your deck. Kindle. Discard an energy from this Pokemon. If you do, discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. Wait a second. What the hell? These are the same Pokemon? I don't understand. Doesn't. But. Oh, whatever. I don't care anymore. Wait. Passionate Dance also does the same thing. Wait, what does it? Wait, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Hold the phone. It doesn't. What the fuck? Oh, that's Passionate Dance. Okay. During your, during your next turn, this opponent's. During your next turn, this Pokemon's Pom Pom Punch attack. Attack space is 100. Damn, that's insane. This Pokemon's insane. I got, I gotta get this Pokemon out there. I gotta fuck people up with that Pokemon. Water gun, 30 damage. Pan Cham, light punch is 10. Com confront is 20. P 
Panguro is a uh, parting shot. Spread this Pokemon with when your bench Pokemon during your opponent's next turn. Turn any damage done by attacks from the defending Pokemon. This is reduced by 60. Okay. Buster Swing. This attack damage. This attack's damage isn't affected by resistance. Okay, so it does 90 regardless. Okay, that's kind of cool. Glance. Look at your the top card of your opponent's deck. Attack level 20. Fan Tump. Okay. Attack level 10 uh, damage. Confuse Ray. Your opponent's active Pokemon is not confused. Hip up, wave splash, 30 damage. Pro bow pass, energy link. Attach a energy card from your discard pallet to this Pokemon. Water, power jam, 120. Oh my god. Ability, mischievous fang. When you play this card from your hand onto your bench, you may discard all Pokemon tool cards attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. That's really good. Rayquaza, or Rayquaza, however you want to say it. Triple Storm, attach two basic energy cards from Discard Pile to one of your bench Pokemon. Drag Claw does 80 damage. Red Steel. Turbo Arm, attach an energy, a, a basic energy card from your Discard Pile to one of your bench Pokemon. Iron Hand. If Fragilize is on your bench, uh, heal 30 damage from this Pokemon. Rock Rough, uh, corner, this is defending Pokemon, can't retreat during your opponent's next turn. About pick, the Pokemon if Tails, this attack does nothing, so you need to get heads to get 50 damage on this, on his face. Rowlet, tackle damage, leaf, uh, phage, leaf, leaf fudge, whatever, leaf age, 20. S Saland it, Saland it. Scratch, 10 damage. Vino Shock, if your opponent's actual Pokemon is poison, this attack does 40 more damage. Okay, cool. Send slash slash 20. So we have this attack's uh, damage isn't affected by weakness, but was resi resistance or any other effects on your opponent's actual Pokemon. Cool. Come on. Slowpoke, headbutt 10, whimsy tackle, uh, flip coin if tails attacks nothing, so heads to get uh, 60 damage on them. Snowball, roar, your pose like flip one uh, is switched to one of their bench Pokemon, bite 40 damage. Spoink, 10 splash damage. Uh, sorry, you. flip a coin if heads attacks 10 more damage. Okay, stuffle. Flop, 30 damage. Stuffle again. Stuffle. Tackle is 10 damage. Hammer in is 60 damage. Pseudo Woodle. Uh, ability. <clears throat> opponents uh, can't have more than 4 bench Pokemon. If they have 5 bench Pokemon, they have to discard bench Pokemon until they have 4 bench, four Pokemon on their bench. If more than 1 uh, changes. If more, th if more than 1 effect changes the number of bench Pokemon. Allowed, use the smaller number. Okay. So I'll be back in Blind Wound. Heal 20 damage from one of your Pokemon. Cool. Now this is what I was waiting for. Whew. Woo wee. Wait a second. How did I... What? We'll look into this later. Because I thought I... There was... Okay. I'll, I'll explain later. Magical Ribbon. Search your deck for up to three uh, cards and put them onto or into your hand. Then shuffle your deck. Fairy Wind. 110. Oh. Plead GX. Put two of your opponent's bench Pokemon and all cards attached them onto your opponent's hand and to your opponent's hands. You can't use more than one time. GX is a tactic game. Okay, so this, you can only use this move right here one time. That's it. Tangla, blind or bind. Flip a coin if, if your opponent, if heads your opponent's active Pokemon is not paralyzed. Poison powder. Opponent's active Pokemon is not poison. Tentacle, sludge shock. The pin Pokemon can't be healed during your opponent's next turn. That's really cool. I might use that. Tentacruel, poison sting. Opponent's active Pokemon is not poisoned. Flip a coin if heads. 
This tag does 40 damage or 40 more damage. If tails, your opponent's like Pokemon is not paralyzed, so it's good either way, in my opinion. But I prefer the damage because it does 80, and it's called Sink Seething Tentacles. How appropriate. Torkoal! Sorry. Pokemon. Uh, Singe. Your opponent's, uh, opponents. your opponent's active Pokemon is not burned. Flip the body slam. If a coin, flip a coin. If heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Okay. That's a really interesting thing, too. Looks kind of cool. I, like, I really like it. Trevent. Tre Tre Trevident? Who's we'll called Trevident? Uh, pol Poltergeist. Your opponent reveals their hand. This attack does 30 damage for each training card you find there. Ooh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We must. We must. Okay. Horn Leech. Heal 30 damage from this Pokemon. Trevor, stomp off. Uh, discard the top card of your opponent's deck. Jewel, 30 damage. That has to be also one of the stupidest cards I've ever made. Trash can. <laughs> Acid spray. Flip a coin if heads. Discard an energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. Vanellish. Ice shard. Your opponent's active Pokemon is a fighting type Pokemon. This attack does 30 more damage. Okay. Whoa, it has, oh, okay, I thought about to say it has no weakness, what? Oh, wait, didn't I just, yeah, I did, didn't I? Oh, well, my bad. Vanillish, put a coin of hits, attack does 30 more damage. It's called Ice Edge, Icy Wind, your opponent's like, is now asleep. Vanillite, triple spin, but three coins attack does 10 damage for each hit, okay. Vanillix, hail. This attack does 20 damage to each of your opponent's Pokemon. Frozen Breath. You may discard two water type energy from this Pokemon. If you do, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. <coughs> Vanellix. Frigid Breath. Until the end of your next turn, each player can't play any supporter or stadium cards from his or her, her hand. My god. Deep Freeze. Flip a coin. If heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. If tails, your opponent's active Pokemon is not confused. Okay. Cool. I better be done soon. My god. <laughs> this video's been going on so long. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned. Confused and poisoned. That's one of the greatest moves I've seen for a long time. Stick in the world. Hail 20 yards from this Pokemon. Defending Pokemon can't retreat during the opponent's next move. Turn. Mail Mare Splash 20 damage, Surf 70 damage, Well, Lord, Dive, from Flip a Coin, if heads, prevent all effects of attacks including damage done to this Pokemon during your opponent's next turn. Okay, he'll 30 damage for each water type uh, Pokemon. Okay. Watchdog. Scrutinize. Look at top two cards of your opponent's deck, discard one of them, put the other card back. Slam. Have two coins attack the standard inch, 60 inch for each um, heads. 120. Wait, 60 inch. So. 70, 80, 90. Yeah, I was right, 120. This one has a Weaver! Weaver! Okay. As often as you like during your turn before you attack, you may put a Pokemon to look. Pokemon to a card attached to one of your Pokemon into your hand. Okay. Slash. For you. Whims Whimsicott. Whimsicott. Whims Whim Whimsicott. Whimsicott. I don't know. If the printing Pokemon is knocked out during your next turn, take two more prize cards. Whoa. Okay. So. Well, that's really interesting. I can win twice as fast. Wish cash. I got this physical version of this too. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep. Linslide. Discard the top three cards of your deck. This type is 100 for each energy card you discarded along the way. 
I hate this one. We have a pod. Scamper away. Shove this Pokemon and all cards attached to it into your deck. Ram, 10 damage. Wishy washy. Are they even trying anymore to make names? I don't. I don't think they're trying with anything anymore. Schooling. Once during your turn, before you attack, you may switch your, this Pokemon with a Wishy Washy GX. In your hand, any attached da cards, damage counters, special conditions, turns uh, in play, and any other effects remain on the new Pokemon. Oh, wow. This attack does 10 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Okay. Actually, yeah, we're getting close, I can tell. Lead. Switch your deck for a supporter card, reveal it, and put it in your, into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Bright Horns, 130. The Pokemon can't use Bright Horns during your next turn. Okay. Handicapped. Young Goose. Tackle 10 damage, by 20. Okay. I did not mean to do that. Okay, that's it. I knew we were close. Okay, time for the trainer cards. Because I know we got some pretty cool trainer cards, so. Actually, I want to check something. Does it, does it? Okay, no, it still keeps the, the new thing on it. Good, because I want to read all this. Okay. Brooklet Hill. Once during each player's turn, that player may search their deck for a basic or type Pokemon or a basic fire type Pokemon. Put it into their bench and shuffle their deck. Okay, that's nice. Choice band. This, uh, the attack of the Pokemon this card is attached to does do 30 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. Active GX or active Pokemon EX. Okay then. We already read that. Energy Lotto. Like the top seven cards of your deck, you may reveal an entry card you find there, put it into your hand, shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Energy Recycler. Shuffle five basic energy cards from your discard pile into your deck. Nice. This is probably 24 minutes, maybe even 30. <laughs> it's been so long. Enhance damage, discard special energy from one of your opponent's Pokemon. The blower. Mm -hmm. Okay. Choose up the two in any com combination combination of the Pokemon tool cards, Pokemon tool cards, and stadium and stadium cards in play, yours or your opponents, and discard them. Okay. I'm very excited for that that one little trainer card that looked really cool. I got. Shuffle two cards from your hand into your deck. If you can't shuffle two cards into your deck, you can't play this card and draw a card. Okay. Sorry, my, my nose itched. I gotta itch my nose. You two spirit link. Your turn does not end if the Pokemon this card is attached to it becomes a Mew. It comes to M Mew 2 EX. Okay. Beacon Red Card. Your opponent reveals their hand. You may have your opponent count the cards in their hand, shuffle those cards into your deck, to their deck, and then draw that many card. That many cards. So if you had seven, I could, I could say six, and then he discards six cards. Wait, wait, no. No, no, okay, so I say one, he discards that card and he draws another card of that amount. That's stupid. Okay. Poison Bart. And the Pokemon this card's attached to is your active Pokemon and is damaged by your opponent's attack. Even if this Pokemon is knocked out, the attacking Pokemon is not poisoned. Okay, so the attacking. Wait, me? No, it would be him, wouldn't it? That would make sense. Why does it make the card like that if they... I don't know. Mmm. 
Oh, this is the one I think I said look cool. Okay. What? Oh, okay. It's like, I can't read that. Uh, choose which way this card faces before you play it. The attack of this player's Pokemon do two, 10 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon before applying weakness and resistance. Okay. So it's a stadium card. That's what Super Potion and heal 60 damage from one of your opponent, one of your Pokemon. If you do, discard a energy attached to that one. Oh, I'm getting close to the end. Uh oh. Oh, we're at the end. Oh. Well, we don't, we don't care about this, do we? Let's, let's just see. You know, let's see what we have. They have to offer. Not much, honestly. Yep, not much. Wait, do I, is that really all I have as far as energy goes? If that's the case, I need more energy. Yeah, I need more energy. Oh, oh, card save, okay, so might as well. Okay, so I'll do uh, Oh, wait, how do I, uh, you know? Apply it to my stuff. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I got a hat for my character. It's really cool. Well. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna say something a uh, while back ago. See that Eevee right there? Eevee Evolution. I that didn't make any sense to me because I didn't think either A I got really lucky in getting that or B somehow I the game must have glitched out or something because I remember I'm on the trainer versus ladder. And I think that's actually the prize, the, the end prize, uh, is that card right there. So let me just go back to the beginning of this and then we'll check that out real quick before I end the video. Okay, so. That wasn't it, was it? Yeah, no, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. Oh, no, it wasn't it. It was, it was a different version of the Eevee. Okay, well, this deck does 10 more damage for each Pokemon. Damage for each damage counter on your opponent's active Pokemon during your opponent's next turn. Prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from evolution. Well, there we go. There we go. Well, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I know I enjoyed making it. Um, Peace out. Bye.